what is harmful for our health? Drugs or alcohol? What do you say about fast food? Your tongue might want such charming and fascinating food for your dinner, but do you know how junk food threatens our health behind the McDonald's clown? Nowadays, I see so many people who eat lots of junk food are overweight. In 2008, almost 1.5 billion adults in the world were overweight, and another billion were obese. In America, about one in three children are now overweight or obese. Food, fast food eaters' hearts cannot support their cholesterol-absorbed bodies. If there is too much bloating in your artery, arteries, your heart has to assert more effort in pumping blood, which makes us bloating. This, the excess amount of cholesterol in your body can destroy the liver as well, leaving you overweight at the same time. High blood pressure due to great amount of sodium from junk food can also occur. What a traffic snare without a backbone, and what a liver blocked by a barrier in the way of your heart. Do you still not believe how harmful it is? Losing moderation and eating junk food also causes development of cancer. The body desires and needs certain amount of vitamins and minerals to function, function properly. But when you eat poor diet, you severely impair the body's ability, its immune system to fight off of toxin and disease cells. As a result, these cells can become cancerous. Fast food may look like marshmallow in the experiment that the most people couldn't suppress their cerebral gland in their mouth. By this, you can tell if you control yourself, you will meet the better result. Consuming high fat junk food can actually have a direct impact on the brain and cause mental illness due to chemical changes. According to research featured by the Huffington Post, the lack of omega-3 fatty acid in the fast food can create a mental state that includes ADHD along with de depression. Fast food is high in refined carbohydrates, which can lead to blood sugar fluctuations. If your body sugar dips into hypoglycemic levels, you can experience you can experience anxiety and confusion. All, all of these negative things happen while you're eating fast food. I, I suggest you not to ignore your mental health and thank for your health that is not affected by fast food yet because an unconscious misjudgment can cause your an erroneous conclusion. In article, fast food should not be blamed for obesity, says some fast food restaurants have continuously expanded their menus for a variety of reasons including health concerns. On March 10, 2003, Burger King unveiled a new line of premium hamburger that featured new ones on or natural dressing. However, these are just a part of marketing. Even though many fast food companies are trying to brainwash, you should not justify yourself for healthy fast food. Still, lots of sugars and meats cannot get better your health. In one single patty contain 85% lean green beef and four ounces of lao meat. It would have amount it would have about two hundred fats. This fat and sugar from fast food enters, enters the brainstream and gain access to the pleasure center. This, this activity can, causes us to increase our production of chemical called dopamine, which creates the high blood pressure that is associated with drug and alcohol intake. And the reason why eating chocolate makes us feel better. This means that we have to eat more and more fat and sugar in order to get the same feeling, good response, so this 
develops into a addiction. Eventually, the body gets used to having fat and sugar and fails to fun function properly without it. I believe fast foods are unknown drug that human beings don't notice. So don't be a blind person who so, so far your health is concerned. Don't trust the fast food companies which make you mentally unhealthy. Don't invest your money for tasting a bunch of sugar. The clown's deadly weapon is aiming your health, causing a better blow. Without distinction of sex and age, the Burger King, the king size and sweet sugary big burgers behind the seductive and fancy advertisements deceive us. Listen to your heart and brain, and don't listen to your selfish tongue. Controlling yourself or not makes a trembler's